morning, y'all. Uh, it's about 7 o'clock. And uh, here we head to do get some feed and stuff. So I'm going to do a review, or kind of a short review of this Copenhagen Southern one. Finally got my hands on it. Found it at a gas station. So, anyway, I'm going to throw it in a dip. I got to hurry up. Anyways, uh, sitting in the uh, snow cam on my jug. Just pulling out a drive right here. Uh, a lot of people, what I've heard, they think the southern plant tastes a lot like sweet tea. <laughs> I think I can taste a little bit of sweet tea in it, but in some ways I kind of smell or taste the, uh, maybe a little bit of peach. Uh, I think it's, I think it's really good. I think Copenhagen done a great job on this. Uh, I know I ain't made a video in a while, and that's because I've been like crazy. Uh, I haven't went to bed yet. I've been going for about, about two or three days straight. Uh, it's, yeah, it's like seven o'clock. Just got done feeding the calves. Fed them a little bit late this morning. And now I gotta go pick up some feed, milk replacer, some hay. I gotta get all that before I gotta be at work at nine. So, uh, I'm gonna stop and get something to eat. But I'm gonna make a video earlier this week. I, I'm, I'll probably do another review on the southern plant. But I seen Outlaw back and he finally got his hand on the southern plant. So I'm waiting on the video for him. I'll tell you a story about this morning while I was out there feeding calves. Um, if you all don't know, I'm pretty much, I'm terrified of big ass players. Just, I'm terrified of players. You know, them little parts don't bug me, but them great big something. Screw that. You'll see me fucking scream like a little girl. Whoa, whoa, whoa. But, uh, I came in the barn this morning and I was feeding one of them. I looked there on the side of the wall and I swear to God, this friggin' spider would cover my fucking hand and then some. A huge son of a fucker. Needless to say, I about jumped on the gas. I friggin' hate spiders. Snakes, stuff like that don't bother me a bit. You can have them for your water. But, um, yeah, it's just a little video of drive to work or whatever. We've got about a uh, 25 minute or so drive to town. And, uh, I'm gonna stop at Burger King or something to get some bread on the work. And we'll probably be going to the fair tonight. Germantown Fair, I don't know, maybe tonight or something. Uh, maybe not. We're supposed to have the demolition derby and stuff tonight. So, uh, and I usually go pretty much every time I have the tractor pull and stuff. I won't, I got a buddy that goes to the tractor pull. He got first place last week. So I'll probably go watch him. These tractors that are pulling, these are these 15, 1600 horsepower tractors to run on alcohol. And these no bitches bad. But anyways, um, I'm pretty much chilling on that road. Um, it's like five minutes into the video and I haven't even got out the German town yet. I haven't got close to town. But I still got another I gotta got go to Southern State, and then I gotta go to the Mason Mill. Mason Mill is like an extra 35 minute drive in town. So, uh, anyway, I'm 
always just my little quick for you. I love the Copenhagen Slam. Uh, I really like it. If you ever try it, just make it a chance. And I'm going to cut this video off. And you all know where I'm going. So, uh, anyways, that's what I'm doing today. I don't know if you can see that or not because of the sun, but anyways, I'm cutting this video off. Check out this guy's field. He got that alfalfa growing on the back side. And he's got his soybeans growing on the, this side. Here comes the fuel truck. Anyways, that's the end of my video. Talk to you later.